What's up everyone, and today we've got my breakfast, and it is the, the lazy breakfast this morning. So that consists of the cornflakes, or milk, and then some uh, couple of seeds as well. I say lazy breakfast because this just takes like two minutes to make. I uh, probably have um, some little bit of toast or something afterwards as well, some peanut butter on it, and then head off out for my walk. For a walk in the woods this morning, cold, uh, cold today, but absolutely stunning. Everybody do about two hours or so um, up and down hills. I'll burn some calories for sure. Just got back now, two hours done. Uh, I was nine kilometers, very pleased with that. And I got my little protein shake now to have afterwards. So I got milk, vanilla whey protein, and a banana. And this, oh, it's whisked up. And God, this is so nice. Do you know what, I'd love to open my own like gym and I'd have, I'd have like a little cafe on the side of it and we'd sell these and coffees and things like that and oh, it'd be amazing. These are incredible. These, these, these are better than, you know, you, you, know, you go to these like milkshake places, uh, you can buy these real nice expensive milkshakes that cost like five, six, seven pounds and they've got all ice creams and all these sort of, loads of sugar in and that. And they're delicious, but this is even bloody nicer, and it's got you know goodness in it as well. It's good for training, so I'm going to take you to these. <laughs> Next meal, we have got the uh, very hot container. <laughs> it's um, chicken and pasta, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to let that cool down before I eat that. Oh my god. Whew. <laughs> What do you want? You want some chicken? Chicken? <laughs> you want chicken? Someone else here wants to have some chicken. So, oh, time to start training, and this one here is chest and back. Super setting, pulling with pushing. Shoulders up, whole body up as well, especially the joint, elbow joints, uh, shoulders in particular, chest. Uh, now, so on to the next exercise, our first proper exercise, that is going to be weighted pull ups. Uh, Supersetted with dumbbell finger press on an incline. Do like three sets of each one. 
before we move on to the next exercise. Next superset we've got is the bent over dumbbell row, superset with the flat barbell bench press. Three sets of 12, I'm sticking to three sets at the moment, excluding my warm up sets. I've done a few warm up sets before I had lightweight build it up, and then I've got the working sets, three sets of 12, both exercises, 100 kilos. I felt a lot stronger with that one, I was able to kind of remember the actual exercise, so I feel like I can progress a lot more now, and I feel my strength coming back. First one the other day just felt a bit ropey, I'm not sure, quite sure what I was doing, but I'm remembering now, I'm keeping everything tight, tucking things in, um, and pushing up as well. Uh, right, so moving on to the next exercise, which is going to be a close grip chin up. I did a lap pull down last time, I'm going to mix it up and do a, a chin up this time. And I'm going to do some light dumbbell flies as well. I know they are not seen as great for the shoulders. A lot of people don't like these exercises. Um, I'm going to go light. I've always had good results with this exercise, so that's why I'm going to keep it in my routine. Uh, I haven't done close grip chins for a while, I'll see how we get on. look forward to doing them but I used to do them with 38 kilogram dumbbells in each hand uh, towards the end of a workout. The amount of strain I've probably put on my shoulders probably a bit daft really looking back on things but my chest, to be fair my chest has never been as good as it was back then. I was about 10 years ago um, upper body was pretty solid back in those days. Moving on to the next part of the workout it is a three exercises so it's a giant set and uh, it's going to consist of pullovers with a 15 kilo weight, dips and uh, hanging leg raises. Today's workout done, uh, so chest and back completed. I am waging war on the fat. I got 7% of body fat I want to get rid of. I've had enough of it, and I'm hoping that just by getting rid of that body fat, toning the muscles up a little bit, I should really start to uh, look noticeably, well, significantly better. I believe I can do that in such a short amount of time. Now, um, all workouts, I, forgot, I keep forgetting to stress this um, in these videos, but all workouts must finish, I finish each workout with a stretch. Uh, of, the, of the muscles that I've worked. Sometimes I'll, I'll stretch other muscles as well. So I'm constantly stretching my calves at the moment. Anyway, so fitness professionals, we need to make sure that we're showing people that we are stretching as well. I'm not really kind of showing that on the camera, so I'm going to do a few stretches afterwards. I've got a full comprehensive warm-up routine and a cool-down routine as well. Uh, so straight away after training, protein shake. Oh my God, that's so nice. Um, and I'll shower and then some food. First evening meal is going to be Pot of cottage cheese there. This time I haven't got the fancy pineapple flavour. So um, pretty much good to go. Um, best before, well, about one week ago, but yeah, it should be fine. Yeah. 
Yeah. What's a little bit watery yet. Yeah. Uh, let's give it a go, innit? What's the worst that can happen? I'm trying to lose weight anyway, you know. Yeah. We got this evening's meal and it is looking nice. We got uh, plenty of salad, a uh, little bit of uh, tuna fish, but uh, unfortunately the cats ate half of it, so I've had to supplement it with a little with an egg there just to make up for the protein that they um, that they stole from me. Got to get my good quality protein in this evening. Avocado, tomato, peppers, and uh, cucumbers. Use pumpkin and sesame seeds too. I'm looking forward to polishing this off and then heading to bed very very shortly. Catch you tomorrow, guys. Cheerio. Bye-bye.